One of the biggest challenges that we face when operating on brain tumors is reaching the tumors that are deep within the brain. I'm Zach Litvak, Director of Skull Base and Minimally Invasive Neurosurgery here at Swedish Neuroscience Institute in Seattle, Washington. For a very deep-seated tumor, operations used to involve a large opening, significant amount of trauma to the surrounding brain to reach the tumor or the other abnormality, and then a prolonged recovery, three to five days in the ICU, maybe a rehab stay. Here at Swedish, we're fortunate enough to have a lot of advanced tools to use in the operating room. We have two devices here, first place in the Pacific Northwest to offer this technology that work together. One is the Synaptive Bright Matter Robot. This is an incredibly high resolution, very precise optical video microscope that allows us to visualize structures at high definition. It is smart enough to track where you're working in real time, and so it follows me as I work. We're seeing more than we can see with the naked eye. The processing of the image feed is enhanced to allow us to better differentiate tumor from normal surrounding tissues. The other thing is this device here. This is called a Nico Brain Path. It's a tubular retractor, so it allows us to use much smaller openings both in the skull and the brain. This is the largest area that the brain is disrupted. So the whole tumor is removed through a 13 and a half millimeter port. And by moving in real time, as we move the tube around to reach different parts of the tumor, it allows us to do resection of relatively large tumors underneath the surface of the brain through an opening that's about the size of a silver dollar depending on the size of the tumor, the exact location, you could be looking at a two to three hour operation. Afterwards, patients, because it's a minimally invasive procedure, relatively minimal pain, and most people would expect to spend one night in the ICU barring any complications, and then going home within a day or two of surgery.